Arsenal are struggling. What can Wenger do in the summer to restructure this team and make it more competitive? Hello. We've got five of the hottest candidates to be wearing an Arsenal kit next season. What do you think about Lacazette? I mean, he's obviously got the firepower in Ligue 1, but can he bring it in the Premier League? Let us know in the comments below if you think he would be the missing link for Arsenal. Fornals is a hot prospect in Spain, but it's too early to tell if he can reach his potential. No offense to Malaga, but they're no Barca or Madrid, and he hasn't proved himself on the biggest stage yet. Yanko is another youngster you may not have heard of, but with an international debut under his belt and in flying form for Udinese, it's clear he's not a fly-by-night player. Could he bring something to this Arsenal team now? With a couple up-and-coming youngsters in there, should Wenger be investing in the future, or is his time now? Because time is running out, Wenger. Tick tock, tick tock. But I think our next guy has him covered there. Schalke fans would be devastated to let Kolasinac go, especially on a free. But the German Bosnian youngster is destined for bigger and greater things, and Arsenal could be that bigger stage. He could even be a mainstay in their lineup for the next several years. After several loan spells in the lower leagues, Pickford has established himself as the first choice keeper at Sunderland. He has even made the shortlist for the PFA Young Player of the Year. Could he be the replacement for Czech? Or is he just too raw? That's for Wenger to decide. Well, that's it for now. Which of these five players will be playing at the Emirates next season? Let us know below, watch another Arsenal video here, and subscribe here. Hi! My name is Vincent, and I think you should all listen to what Fab just said.